Okay, got an Asa Twin Baltic Exclusive. That is the bidding. Key works. I have been struggling with these barrel pins. Because going off the artichoke video on how to pick them, he says that half the people he interviewed say that set barrel pins feel uh, solid and binding pins feel solid so I can't tell the difference between a set one and a binding one I just kind of play with them until I think I've got it and when I get done with the side pins if it doesn't open I know I screwed it up Most of those clicks were just my pin deflect or my pick deflecting off the pins and striking the warding. So we'll have to see how I get on. Somebody just messaged me on Discord Two feels good Three still feels loose Four Oops, up one Solid. Now it feels good. Four feels good. Five on this still feels loose, so something's not right. One feels good. Two feels good. Three feels good. Four feels good. And five is still loose. Try a little more tension, see if they get something to bind. Nope. So that means I've got a barrel pin that's not right. Click off a six, but I don't notice any additional core movement, so I don't know if that's the one I was looking for.
it seems to be moving up there. So, one still feels good. Two still feels good. Three still feels good. Four still feels good. And five. Ooh. Just bound up. Feels good. I don't know why. Just not double checking pin one. Maybe I wasn't going far enough pin one. Far enough forward. Seven minutes in. And three was bound tightly. Feels good now. And pin five. A lot of core rotation, but not an open. What is holding me up? Pin three feels good. Feels solid. But No, I've overset three now. Oh, and I think I dropped everything, everything. Yeah, pin one on here is usually my first binder, and it is loose. Which means I dropped some barrels.
is still loose. Feels good. Screwed that up. if that's where I want it or not. Yeah. I've definitely overset four again. Or overset five again, which means one of these barrels is, is not good. I need to figure out a better way to identify which one of these is causing me trouble. Stay on the pin. There we go. Ooh, another 16 minute pick. Fuck. Got it though. All right, gonna lock that back up. Take it out of here. Do better keeping it in frame this time around. I don't know why 
I put the key in yet because I'm going to gut the barrels out the top. Uh, the barrels don't have to be shown to be in a particular orientation. So I'm just going to dump them out and then I'll show the counter milling when I take the core out or take the Bible out. Yeah, the core. So that's pin stack one. Pin stack two. Stack three. Step five. Pin stack six. And I'll zoom in, show those better at the end. So that's all the pin stacks out. There is the core rotate or the yeah, core retention core rotation whoops that's the screw and luckily that's a big piece so that was easy to find put that in just to make sure that all the side pins are retained. So we'll look at the side bar. Come on, focus. So there is all of those unmodified. those springs out just to make sure I don't lose them later in this and let's start going with the side pins now the side pins are all the same come on focus you can do it there we go, side pins are all the same. They got a couple serrations that are pretty shallow, but there, let me move my light, see if I can get better. Uh, yeah. So that's, the first one and it's spring or working from the back here so that'd be five this is number four and again serrations and the true gate right in the middle because they're all identical because the bidding is determined by the sidebar on this those up. Let's 
side pin number three. It's really hard to see, but they are there. And it's spring. Spring fell out. I'm going to put the spring up here since now I'm going under the other one. And side pin two. solid and work for me. That pins with serration. And there is the spring. Again, I'll put it up there. And then we have the milling on the core. Bring the light back so I can see. So there is the milling on the core. I was rotating it this way so it would grab this side of the milling so I'll show that off make sure there's no question there and then the actual housing you can see the sidebar groove unmodified all the way through all right as long as I got that in frame that's black belt number three <laughs>